fly in breakfast that we co-sponsored with the uh, EAA chapter here at Franklin Airport and it basically it was a, uh, a fundraising drive um, to raise money for not only our organization but the EAA chapter. Um, it's, it's really nice being able to help out other organizations and, and by doing such we were able to throw a pancake breakfast today uh, all for a donation so you got to come in eat a you know pancake breakfast and then get to tour the airplane and see what we're doing up here in the hangar. Um, I thought it went pretty well today with a lot of aircraft come in, a lot of people come in and um, you know that's what it's about. This is how organizations like this raise money and it takes a, as you can see, a, an entire army of people here to make stuff like this work but we're, we're lucky we had a really good team. I think today was a pretty good success. I just want to thank everybody for uh, taking the time to come out today, all of our volunteers for uh, putting aside their time and, and uh, volunteering and cooking the pancakes and working the money box and doing tours and uh, for all the folks who came out today to uh, you know, uh, donate money and their time uh, to help organizations like ours in the EA chapter uh, continue on with our missions. Brings back memories. Yeah. Now, Damn, that's a good looking guy. <laughs> <laughs> Very made, nice. I made that special for I'll you. I'll tell you what. <laughs> Better than those web seats. Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> Just an outstanding job you guys did. Thank you. Outstanding job. We had two squadrons, the ninth and the fourth. Fourth was gunships, ninth was Cy Okay. The Cy Warbird had uh, nothing inside it except a hole in the floor right here. Okay. The flap on it. You know, propaganda leaflets. They had three guys, two of them feeding, one of them dumping them out to, to call them bullshit bombers. <laughs> <laughs> they have a spooky right above us. As soon as they'd suited us, Oh wow. That only worked a few times. Yeah. yeah. I'm sure they caught on to that. Yeah. Long before I got there, they caught on to that. <laughs> should be preserved. You know, this is now, Vietnam is now kind of a forgotten war. You know, my grandkids, my kids, they know very little about it, you know. Uh, so, yes, we should keep up so many. I'm prone to get emotional here, so. So many guys. Oh, they should be remembered. A couple of guys I knew, in fact. A lot of organizations started a project like this, never finish it. And when they started this, I thought, I thought I'm not gonna live, live to see this finish. <laughs> Year later, there she is, wow. Pretty impressive, yeah, yeah.